Hey guys, Eamon here, back with another NRL reaction. We are on round, is it 18? 18? 19. Round 19, holy smokes, we've been doing this for a while now. Jesus, guys, yeah, round 19. Um, yeah, only five matches this week because it's Origin origin Week, obviously, so there's going to be uh, a few buys. Um, yeah, I guess lots of players missing as well. Um, yeah, before we hop into it, I guess, yeah, I am going to be doing a live watch party for Origin Game 3 on uh, Wednesday. Should be a fun time. Uh, it's going to be 3 in the morning for me, so I might be a little little, little more out of it than usual. But um, yeah, make sure to tune in. It should be an awesome time for a great game. Um, yeah, we'll see. Yeah, let's go from there. Uh, make sure to sub, leave the video, comment your thoughts on the round. Um, yeah. Yeah, let's hop into it. All right. So, first up, we have um, Dolphin Drabados. Uh, this one I had what was my pick. Rabbids by four. Rabbids by four was my pick. Um, yeah, Rabbids have been hot. Dolphins. Um, I forget who was missing from. Um, I know. Yeah, Mitchell's missing for the Rabbids, right? That's that's the main guy, I think. I forget if the Dolphins are missing anyone, but I, I know I want the Rabbids. Rabbids have been hot, so I just went with them. Uh, we'll see what happens, though. Um, you never know. It could, it could just be a flash in the pan last streak for the Rabbitohs. So we'll see, I guess. Let's hop into it. Redcliffe tonight. The Dolphins at home against the Rabbitohs. It's an important one. Well, they're all important at this stage of the season. Yeah, it'd be crazy. If they can win another one, the Rabbitohs, like, Bromwich, you guys were saying it's basically impossible for them to make finals. But, like, oh, not a good start. Okay, five minutes in. Jack Bostock. Prolific Jack Bost oh, is that, um, what's... His sister. His sister was in the the uh, the origin, right? She's like an up and coming like superstar on the women's side. Yeah. Bostock. Yeah, ooh. Oh, what a! No way. What was that? That awful, and he booted it. Oh, did he, oh, was it a knock on? Oh no, he lost. He lost control of it. Oh, there is a penalty try. Okay. Okay, interesting. How's this looking at if it's a knock on there, but we'll see it Ooh. Oh, no way. Is that boss talk again? Yeah. Jeez, he looks really tall. Oh, nice off There's too much red in this game. <laughs> I'm not a huge fan of red uniforms, and the red with the green is crazy. All right, there's Dolphins again. Oh, what a pass. That was sick. Jacob Gagai. Oh, what a run. You get it? Yeah, okay, I thought... I thought the rabbit was. Oh, he reached out. Okay, he couldn't see from that angle. I thought the rabbit. Look at the rabbit was at. I got my bit. Jeez. Oh. Oh, dude. Dude. Okay. This boss that guy seems good in these highlights. At least I haven't seen much of him. Oh, good tackle. He seems to have really good hands. The boss dog. Oh. Uh oh. There you go, rabbit. Let's go, go. Go, go, go. Oh, a good tackle. Ooh. That was a wild pass. Oh, and then he gives it back. And then, oh, what? Good step. Good step. Oh, he, oh, he throws it away. Jeez. Katoa. Take it. Oh, what a pass. Yeah, jeez, okay, yeah, the Dolphins running in with this. Katoa, I forget, I forget him. Katoa is good, I remember watching him pass, and he's, he's pretty good. There you go, yeah, but it's going to back a bit. Yeah, there's time, but... Gagai, he just forces his way over. Oh, what a touch. Step. Oh, no way. That was unreal. It was like three guys that you got through. Alex Johnston comes in off the wing there. Yeah, that touch was so cool. Tip. Good step. Runs through that guy. Breaks this tackle and then just slams it. Unreal. 
Yeah, that was sick. Oh, what an awful one. He was like sideways. Jeez. Oh, what a. T oh, my. No way. Bro. That was insane. What is happening? This game is some crazy. Oh, my God. Is that Bostock again? Jeez. All right, this is not getting good. That guy looks really small. Trey Fuller. He looks like he's very short. Yeah, go get, get, get one back for the Rabbitohs. Nice. Jeez, there's been so many tries in the last, like, five minutes. Ten minutes or so. Get another one before that? I guess, yeah, damn. Okay, Rabbitohs Rabbitohs not going to win this one, I think. But. Yeah. All right, 36, 30. Oh, he missed. Dude, they missed. They missed the. Uh, how did he miss the kick there? That was a pretty close. Uh, they got it to the middle, kind of, didn't they? Right. Yeah. So disappointing result for the Rabbitohs there. I was kind of, yeah, I was kind of rooting for them to go on a little run here, but um, yeah, it doesn't look like they're gonna gonna do that. Like, they kind of need to take every game they could. But yeah, props to the Dolphins. Big win. Big win for them. Um, let's take a look at the comments. I, I, I actually don't think I saw any. I, I was asking you guys last week. I think was it last week? In in one of my videos, I asked if you guys liked me reading the comments of the of the highlights. Um, let me know if you do. I I, I kind of seem like the, some of them some of them there's some funny stuff, but yeah, let me know. It's don't I don't need to read it. Um, yeah, holy moly, these highlights are insane. Looks like everyone is running at full speed, placing with everywhere. Haven't seen this speed of play before. Is this like I kind of agree with this, but this almost reads as sarcasm. Was it sarcasm? No, I guess it wasn't sarcasm. Okay, weird. Yeah, no, I agree with that though. That was, that was a, the, the comment was almost written sarcastically though. It's, it felt like um, Trey Fuller needs to find a club where he's the number one option at fullback. He's one of the most naturally gifted players, like a, like a Matt Bowen or Preston Campbell. And I hate to see him be the second string option to hammer and waste his career. Okay, okay, he's he's the second stringer behind the hammer. Okay, yeah. Goal kicking was the difference in this game. Yeah, Marshall King returns. It always be a real deal. Finals contender. Yeah. <laughs> all right all right let's move on sharks versus tigers um yeah this one i, I think i what did i predict i picked like sharks by well i only had sharks by eight okay um yeah like sharks if they lose this one like just fold the franchise like come on you guys can't lose i do know uh mine is, is out though with injury right so yeah, I think I was talking about that. Um, maybe the Sharks will start winning some without him. Kind of like how the Warriors are winning without Johnson. But, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. The Sharks have to win to guarantee themselves a position inside the four after this weekend. Big Royce Hunt to get us underway. And the man at W half, Blake Braley. Oh, he's got the longest... Oh, good stab. There's a good opening through the middle. Wow. Oh, okay. Man, I love these Sharks jerseys. Are these different than their usual ones? Oh yeah, they don't have they don't have a red logo. Are those new uniforms? They must be. Don't they usually have a red? Uh, or the the sponsors usually red. Still looks nice. I kind of like the red though, but yeah. I know I just said I don't like red. I like red in small doses. <laughs> there we go. Sharks again. Oh, little, little trash talk to is that Galvin? Yeah. Oh man. Oh yeah, he didn't he had enough speed there. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah easy Sindon. Galvin and Safeheart. Right there, right there, yeah. Nice. Easy. Oh, it's another Katoa? Are they, they're, are they related? Yeah, they're probably really related to the other Katoa. Dolphins Katoa. Oh, that was brutal. This guy doesn't seem to have too much speed, though. Yeah, he's going to get... He's going to get caught? Yeah, yeah, that guy's not very fast. Or he's tired. Oh, yeah, there you go, Sharks. Jeez, yeah. Okay, this is looking like it's gonna be a huge blowout. What is that like? 
Big job for the Tigers here. Yeah, 18 point lead at the half. 22 point lead. Mulatalo knows the whole time he's getting it. They invite the Sharks up. Beautifully executed. Looks beautiful. Yeah. From high, from yeah, these uniforms definitely look different. Uh, just even like the stripes look different than the old ones. Are these just one offs or are these the uniforms going forward? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they look they look really nice. If they saw the red logo though, I think it'd be even better, but yeah, they're still regardless. Alright, yeah, this is this is a blowout. Oh nice. Where's oh my god, where is everyone? <laughs> oh he almost dropped it. Back to Ronaldo, nice. <laughs> oh, what a dude, that was sick. That reminded me of like a uh, American football handoff almost. Just the crazy speed of the fucking man. Nice, nice. Oh, man. Jeez, kid, there's a lot of time left still, too. Oh, good defense. Alright, 46-6. Jeez. 50 to 6. 52 to 6. They're gonna get another one? Oh my god. Oh man. Guys. <laughs> There you go. 56 to 6. Should be 58. Should be an easy kick, right? <laughs> 58 to 6. Sheesh. Holy. What is that? 52 point win? Jesus. <laughs> What's that song? The sharks are here. All right. Well, yeah, that one. Uh, yeah, I should I should have picked up that by like, more. I figured, but yeah, I don't know. I, I don't actually know why I didn't pick them to win by more. But yeah, sharks. Yeah, I was that. That was an easy one. I'm pretty sure most of you guys picked sharks. Um, any comments? Unfortunately, Benji's defensive coaching seems to be as good as his tackling. <laughs> oh my god, how anyone watches Channel Nine will never know. Mind numbing commentary. Yeah, I forget which. I haven't really had any complaints in, in the games I've watched. I haven't had complaints about the commentary, but there definitely is one that I prefer. But, um, yeah. Uh, Got to admire West Tiger's determination to focus on dedication. Get, third, get a third wooden spoon in a row. Respect. You don't get paid more for winning. <laughs> Sharks are good without Heinz. Don't, don't bring, bring Heinz back. Yeah, that's something that'll be interesting to... Um, to look like this this match means nothing right like it's not yeah it doesn't mean anything but um yeah it'll be interesting to see how the sharks would play without Heinz against like good competition uh because yeah you never know like it seems it seems like with johnson out for the warriors it's kind of set like a not a precedent but it seems to be like doing well for the or doing good for the warriors um just like change for the sake of change kind of i don't know i don't know we'll see let, let me know your thoughts all right titans versus eels i had titans by six i think this was my was my uh no, this wasn't my. This was an upset of the week. No. No. Yeah, Titans by six. No, I, I like the Titans. I like I like cheering for them. So we'll just go go for them. Uh, Paramount has been. I, yeah, Paramount has lost a lot recently, right? I believe. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah, Titans Here by six. It's Clint Gutherson who gets us underway. The kick will go down to the end goal, and they'll work it out through Aaron Clark wearing the ten jersey again. He was outstanding. In the opening exchanges last week, as Veros waits, Furman with the play, the ball set, restart once again for it through Campbell over the top for Carl. There you go, Titans. Ten minutes in, nice job. That gets the ball over the top. Got any number of players with attacking ability, haven't they? Mm. Carl Pereira gets the football, scores the try. Ten away from the line. 
Oh, good hands. There you go. Let's go, Titans. In the space of three minutes, two tries in the opening 13 minutes of the game. And that they, missed, they missed the conversion there? Oh, no, I didn't. I thought that was a, a replay after the fact. Okay. Uh-oh. Oh, perfect tackle. Pops the ball right in. Jeez. Oh, what a dude. What is going on? <laughs> he, he stopped himself from from going further with that celebration. Yeah, jeez, okay. Oh, bad pass. Oh, what a pass. Jeez, bad pass and a great pass. There you go, Eels. With his first touch, having just come on the field, nice. scores for Parramatta. AJ Brimson trying to force the issue here. Yeah, that was a great snag, and then the offload, yeah, I, lo I love the like when you, they go like <laughs> the flick it like that. Man. Oh, good pass. Got the bounce. Titans. That was offside, they said. And the pressure does I think. Turn into points for the Titans. Oh, understanding. Didn't I hear the ref say it was off? Oh, no. Yeah, they went to the bunker, confirmed. Okay. He's coming across Kelly. Yeah, I thought I heard the, con the, the ref say, uh, Harvey Norman replay. say offside. Meters out. Hands still there at dummy half. Brown comes to Gutherson. Just sideline to sideline. There we go. Nice. There you go. Through some soft defense on the edge by the Gold Coast. Yeah, they're not out of that. The Titans, yeah, the Titans have been... Uh, Swiss cheese on D in games I've watched, so... Can get another one here? Ooh. Yeah, what a dude. Did he get it? I think he did. I think it went. Yeah, I think it went right between the two. That's yeah, some more like sus defending here. He just went right through the two of them. Oh, actually. Okay. Yeah, the, the, okay, the ref called a try on the field, so the bunker has to find conclusive evidence. Yeah, okay, can we? All right, 24-16. Probably running out of time for the is. And yeah, okay, it's over. Oh, that was, that was close. All right, Titans. It looked like in putting it down, he might have lost oh. the ball. Oh, okay, I think he might have lost. Oh, no way! Well done. What Situation a defending play! I thought it looked close, but it didn't, like... That's crazy. That's one of the best... That, you know, uh... Nah, yeah, nothing. You got stuff there. Eventually, he'll be called to play it there. Here on the goal there coast, the right. Titans have taken down the Eels. 24 16 by eight. All right, Titans by six. There you go. That's a, that's a good pick for me. Happy with that one. All right. Um, Jaden Campbell is the most underrated player in the NRL. Interesting. Interesting. Awesome ball runner. Um, Con Pereira just loves playing this, doesn't he? <laughs> um, 104, what a disastrous passage of play by the Eels winger. Gets hammered, knocks the ball on, and then gets sidestepped not once, but twice by forwards. Okay, let me watch that again. Let's see number two here. Yeah, misses there. He's right here, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's like that. That's why I like reading the comments because that is hilarious. Let me give that a thumbs up. <laughs> Let's see you do better. <laughs> Paramount heels giving the Tigers every chance not to get wooden spoon trifecta. Yeah. All right, let's move on. Broncos, Dragons. Uh, I had dragons by two. Okay, this this was my pick. I think that was my. Was it no? Which pick was it? Seagulls versus Knights? No, I had one game that I picked where I picked like the opposite of what everyone else was picking. I forgot which one it was. It might have been this one, but I feel like the Broncos shouldn't have been that highly picked, right? Because they're 
I've lost like every game lately. But anyways, Dragons by two is my pick. Let's let's get do it. Dragons are missing Hunt and uh, Hunt and Lomax though, right? I believe here. Yeah. Oh, they got the uh, did you just weak jerseys on. Nice. Yeah, Brisbane does. I think the, I think these Broncos jerseys are probably um, they're one of the few uh, jerseys I don't prefer over their um, their regular jerseys. I, I I love the like the the, the, the mar darker maroon that they use in the, in the original jerseys, but for the most part, the jerseys are just like the best ones by far. Same within the AFL. When I was looking at the AFL jerseys, the, the AFL original shoes were insanely cool. Anyways, okay. Oh, big tackle. Oh, that's a Sinbin, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Sinbin. That must be like underratedly hard to not like um like in that situation where you take the sin bin like it must be hard to like not engage someone right there where you like you obviously not allowed to when you're when you're is it like the two guys closest is that what it is you can't engage i'm always confused but not confused by that rule but like that exact definition i guess but sometimes but yeah it's I can understand why people would would engage. There you go. All right, Dragons are doing good right now. Oh my, brutal! Oh jeez! <laughs> Look, at the, they had. We did it. Oh yeah, he got it. He got it. Jesus! He had five guys on his back. That's insane. Jeez, okay, this is blowout. Christian Tui Pilatu. Patrick already. Jeez, it's still 36 minutes. But my Dragons by two pick might not have been uh, the best one there. And the Broncos are just a mess. Like, holy. They were hyped up so much to me, at, like, early in the season, too, and they're just like. They're like gonna miss finals at this rate, unless their schedule is really easy the rest of the way. But um, yeah. All right. We got a little bit back into it, but that's yeah, probably. Oh, actually. Ooh. Excuse me. All right, thinking a couple here. Ooh, was that? Oh no. Okay, I thought that might have been a, a penalty. Ooh, that was. Make meters get any sort of momentum. Oh, fuck. Oh, there. Show a replay of that. Come on, NRL. Look at this hit. Oh. Jeez, that was a that was a, a hospital pass and a half. Holy. Oh, good step. Oh, he's got the speed. Jeez, what a run! The guy chasing him was flying too. This that guy just burnt away. He used the use the angle as an edge. Oh, another huge tackle! Oh, watch out, dragons! Watch out! All right. Yeah, pretty good. All right, yeah, that's that's out of reach. 30-16. Actually, yeah, is there time? Probably not enough time, but that'd be insane. Let's see. Moser. Another highly talented youngster for the Broncos? Okay. Jeez, if they get another one right here, there's enough. No way. Oh! Oh my god, no way! Uh-oh! Oh my god, Dragons. Is my pick going to be correct? There's no way. What is the... 
<laughs> oh, they missed the conversion. No. <laughs> Damn, okay. Dragons by four almost got it perfect, and they didn't. That's the second time this season I've uh, I've got my margin incorrect by two because of a missed conversion at the buzzer. That sucks. All right, but yeah, Dragons. Dragons with the win there. Um, yeah, the Broncos are just free-falling right now. It's crazy. I guess they have been... Um, I mean, it's not all because, because of Walsh, right? Like, Walsh, like Walsh obviously, he, he was out with Origin, and then he was injured, and then he's out with Origin again. So they've probably been hurt, I guess, by that a decent amount, right? But still, like, they're just losing every game. It's insane. Uh, Brisbane was when we started a fight after they score a try when they realized that they have a six-game losing streak. <laughs> Broncos thought they scored the winning try and wanted to start a fight. Broncos' ambition outweighs their skills. <laughs> Tui, Tui Peloto was unstoppable. Yeah, he had, he's the hat-trick guy, right? If the Broncos were a spice, they'd be flower. They're like a lighthouse in the desert, bright but not very useful. That's poetry, man. That's poetry. How Tyrell Sloan plays first grade is beyond me. All right. All right. Okay, let's get into our last game. Seagulls versus Knights. I had Knights by four. Um, yeah, Seagulls obviously missing two, like the, the, the captains at Origin are missing, obviously. Um, so that's huge. I think they have another couple of guys too, right? Yeah, they're one of the more um, decimated teams from Origin. Um, why is there a trophy here? What does this say? Malcolm Riley Challenge Trophy? Huh. Is this like, are, are these like two teams that are really close together? I mean, I mean, lots of teams are close together, but they, they have like a rivalry that's gone on for a long time, so they have like a trophy for it. I know some teams like to do that but um let me know what this is well, actually maybe i can just look it up malcolm riley challenge shit i just spoiled myself on the result of the game <laughs> i'm so stupid okay anyways i had nights by four i i just saw the eagles won the game though. That's the damn it i'm i'm, I'm, I'm so dumb on this Sunday afternoon, the Knights have got the ball. It's all stacked against them, isn't it? A lot of emotion here at Brookvale. Let's see how big the gap is, though. The bench started as hooker for a few weeks. Now he's out onto the edge as Tom joins in. And Gary we'll get past him. And he feeds Saab down the wing. Nice. And he's the first gamer with the first try. There you go. First game for him. Nice. That's a good story. That's the cool thing about Origin. Um... It lets it lets so many like young players get like a chance to play, which is pretty awesome. Most of the time, guys, the young guys and stuff, they don't really get a chance unless there's injuries or that sort of stuff. But, uh, oh wow, that was sick! <laughs> what was that? He's back, all right. Tom Trebojevic back in his favorite fullback position. Or I guess that's still the, oh, the what was it called? Um, says, well, that's what I've been you guys told me about that. It's like the, <laughs> it's like for charity where everyone does celebrations in, in July, I believe. It was in July. Yeah, that's, that's why people have been doing that. They should just do that all the time. But, but um, yeah, pretty funny. Sending numbers and Thomas Kent will show it here. This gets him on the outside. Just a faster player. Sam, he tiptoes. And then... Yes. Pulls the batteries out and doink. Oh, he did. <laughs> you know, falling down a moat. Ooh. Oh, he got it. He got the off foot. Okay. I didn't even see that. Otherwise, that was a try to Turbo. Humphreys spears it for Brooks. A kick out wide, a flat kick lead. No. Oh! No way! The catch and pass was insane, and the kick was insane too. But... Jeez, okay, this is an absolute blow for the Eagles right now. Holy. Nice. This guy looks crazy fast. Number two. Yeah, number two looks like he's like a like a sprinter or something. He's like got crazy long legs. And he's really fast. Yeah, yeah, this is a massive ball. Why Zuzu D Max replay just sitting back on their hurls, waiting, waiting, and then Hopawati, he just burns them down the outside and no one covering. He strolls around. <laughs> Fly him like an eagle. Working how to 
Okay, Knights can get a point here. Let's see. Oh, good tackle. I didn't even see that guy go get down for the tackle. What? What just happened? Oh my god. Good, good save. What just happened there? Yeah, what? There was no dummy ass, so he just took the ball? No one out on this side of the ground for Newcastle. Beautiful catch Jeez. by Turbo. Are they going to replay that? Because I was I couldn't see what happened there at all. Try for Manly. Can you believe that? They'll want to be they want to be turning them away. Let me know what happened there. I I didn't I couldn't see exactly what happened. I'm assuming the guy when they when they restarted play, he like threw it to where the dummy F should have been, and he just wasn't there. So he just he just like intercepted it or something. That sounds kind of what happened, but yeah, let me know for sure. Okay, this is yeah, this is one of the biggest blowouts of the, of the season. It looks like. Watch him change his line as he gets the ball. Actually, I just as they scored, I thought that was a Seagulls score. My bad. It wasn't as big of a blowout as I thought it would be. Now here's a chance for the first game up for Lalo. Ball back to Humphrey. Nice, nice. Destined to score another one here if they send it left. Simpkin Brown Brooks thought about a kick, went to Turbo on the Lee High Hop He's had a blind 44. All right, 44 to 6. Really She's 38 so point. Feet. Yeah, the number two. Who's this guy? Have I seen this guy play or is he, a, is he like a guy that's not usually in the lineup? Because he looks, he looks massive. Jeez. Um, all right, Knights play should hand back their pay to the club after that. <laughs> <laughs> what strong defense for the Knights attack with spot on two should be proud. <laughs> Turbo is back. Good game for Manly. God damn. Hapo, how do you say it? Oh man, I, I remember reading his name last uh, like recently. I forgot how you say it. So Hapoet, Hapo, I don't man. Really tough to watch from us Knights fans. Yeah, Turbo Manly is his different. Okay, let me uh, let me look at who is uh. Manly Sea Eagles Turbo. Who is this guy? Oh, okay. It's oh, it's Tr it's Trebojevic's, uh Is his brother? Oh, this is okay. This is the guy that I, I thought wasn't like that good because of his games and stuff. Has it just been injuries that he's not been? Yeah. I, I'm, wait, is this the same guy? No. Where was the other brother? It might have been the other, the third brother. I think it was Ben actually that I saw that. No, no, it was it was definitely Tom. Why did I think Tom wasn't good? I must not have seen his tries because he like gets like a tr like so many tries, twenty eight tries this season. That's insane. In eighteen games, and he had ten and eleven, seven and ten this season. Okay, I apologies if I didn't. Uh, yeah, but yeah, it looks like he was out for um he was out for six to eight weeks and he's back now and now he's yeah. Okay, so that's good. So, so both both the Trebog or the two there's two good good brothers, and then Ben Ben's kind of just like the third guy. He's like the third Hemsworth. Just isn't that great, I don't think. But actually, it says here he has. Oh, no, that's in his entire career. Okay. Oh, and they have a fourth brother. Okay, that doesn't play either. All right. Anyways, good stuff. Right, so that is that is my round nineteen reaction to the NRL. Um, yeah, good round. Some couple couple good games. Um, a lot of blowouts though, but there's a couple. Or there wasn't too many like good games, but there's a lot of good, exciting stuff that happened. Um, so that's good. Um, but yeah, actually, I totally forgot to do the the ladder and stuff. So I have to, like go somewhere in a second. Um, where is NRL draw ladder? Let's see. Let me quick peek the ladder before we hop out oh right, yeah storm panthers yeah storm are kind of pulling away it seems like from the panthers um rooster sharks are still in there yeah it seems to be at the clear big four or the big three storm panthers reaches the clear big three sharks sharks could be but yeah they're kind of pretty meh and then yeah like bulldogs dolphins seagulls seagulls probably have a decent shot at like maybe doing some upsets because yeah they've got a lot of a lot of names um but yeah, the Broncos, man, they got to start winning some games here. That's wild. And then yeah, the Tigers, Tigers and Eels are just battling for the for the spoon. That's crazy. Um, 
and then yeah, draw. I so we yeah, so we we do we have or I'm gonna say we have origin game three we're doing a stream for, and then I think I said I was gonna do storm roosters. I'm gonna do a stream for storm roosters more than likely, assuming most of the players are back from origin. We'll, we'll do this game for sure. Um, on this is Sunday Sunday for you guys, yeah. So no Saturday. Sat yeah Saturday right Saturday evening yeah Saturday evening yeah so we'll do storm roosters and then obviously origin uh, is on. Um, Wednesday, right? Wednesday the 27th. Yeah, so we'll do that for sure. Um, yeah, yeah. Thanks for watching. Yeah, make sure to tune in for those for those uh, streams. Should be should be awesome. Should be two really good games. I really hope Origin lives up to the hype because yeah, the first two games have been like yeah, they haven't yeah. They kind of for game one was just like it was it was over five minutes and game then game two was just like a, a stomping by by the blues so yeah hoping to see like a an all-time classic that'd be awesome awesome to tune in for that is my first uh my first deciding origin game would be pretty sick um yeah anyways yeah like the video subscribe comment um let me know your thoughts on the week let me know who you got for the origin game three um yeah, join the Discord if you're not in there already. Join the tipping leagues. They're all, all that stuff's in the description. Um, yeah, we're wrapping up there. Thanks for watching.